So you have multiple offers that you want to promote on Instagram, but you only have one clickable link in your bio. And you want to know how you can add multiple links to your Instagram bio to get all your offers out there. Well, if that's the case, then stay tuned because this video I'm going to share with you how you can do that. How's it going, my friends? Bob Brown here. Listen, one of our members, Matt Cox of the UK, had sent me a message um, with a question about Instagram. Now, it was a great question, and I wanted to be able to share it with the rest of our community because I really think it would be beneficial, um, those of you that are using Instagram. So I decided to put this video together to kind of tell you a little bit about what I told him in an email that I sent to him. So basically, the question that Matt had was, um, how... Can you maximize your Instagram bio link if you want to promote multiple offers in your Instagram posts? So as you know, um, Instagram only allows you to have one clickable link uh, in your profile, so you want to make the best of it. Okay, and you want to be able to reach more people, but it's only one link, so how are you going to do that? Now Instagram seems to be making some changes in the right direction uh, as far as marketers are concerned. And what I mean by that is that um, um, they, although they've only allowed you to have one link in your bio, they are, um, and they've just recently changed this, they're now allowing you to actually add a clickable link in your direct messages. But in order for this to really be able to work, you've got to have um, a kind of a relationship with the followers. You've got to be able to talk to them. Somebody's got to be following you. So you've started this co communication with them to be able to put the clickable link in there to really be effective with it. Okay, so, so they are moving in that direction. You can put a clickable link in your direct messages, um, which is a great thing, but it's not really the optimal thing. Okay, again, if somebody comes to your Instagram profile, the first thing they're going to look at is your bio. Um, and it's going to describe a little bit about what you're doing there. And to have that link right there, be able to take them to a place that is going to be most effective is really what we want to talk about here. Okay, so the other um, recent thing that uh, Instagram has recently started allowing uh, on some accounts, but not all accounts, is that they're allowing you to put a clickable link in your Instagram stories. Now, I just started playing around with stories. I really like it. I have three accounts, okay? But Instagram is only allowing me to use a clickable link in one of my stories. Now, that particular account has over 10,000 followers in it, and maybe that's the reason for that. I'm not quite sure. I've got my secondary account that's just under 10,000. I'm hoping when it gets to 10,000 that um, I will be able to add a clickable link in the stories there so you can have multiple stories that go across there and that's a really cool thing about what stories are doing now so you can have a story um, and if you have the ability to put a clickable link in your story you can have a story with a clickable link to your your website you can have a a, a story with a clickable link to your Facebook group or your Facebook fan page or to one of your offers so the cool thing about that is right across the top um, just underneath your bio is where your stories go and you can actually add multiple stories in there with the ability to put clickable links in that again that that's not on all accounts unfortunately maybe that'll change in the future I'm not quite sure how that's gonna work but you can't request the ability it has to be a verified account um, uh, on some instances um, but um, uh, maybe that will, like I said, change uh, in the future. Um, but there are a couple of ways that you can get around um, just this one clickable link in your bio to be more effective if you are um, offering multiple um, products or services or, or even just want to take people to different websites um, or different social media accounts um, to be able to do that with. And so I found a couple, and I've used um, a couple of, of, of uh, tools that actually enable you to be able to do that. One of the easiest ways is to use a tool called Linktree. Um, now, this is a free tool, and it turns one link into many by cre creating um, kind of an intermediate landing page um, that allows the visitors to choose where they land on a target website and so it put uh, the one link that you put in your um, Instagram bio actually brings up a landing page and in that landing page there are buttons okay that you can actually um, uh, put different links 
to different places. And here's a, kind of an example of what I'm, I'm, I'm talking about here. As you look at this example, you can see here's the account right here, and here are the, um, the buttons that um, show up in this intermediate, uh, intermediary landing page that shows up there. So that's one of the ways that you can actually do that. Now, I used this for a while uh, because it was free. Okay, there's a free account. They also have a paid version of that. The paid version, what it does is it removes the branding, the Linktree branding on that, and it kind of gives you some other options on um, how the theme actually looks um, um, on your um, landing page there. One of the things I didn't like about that is that um, uh, the actual look of it um, didn't look so pretty. Okay, so you had um, the... Uh, a, circle at the top had your picture on it and then it had just these buttons underneath it and it kind of had these pastel colors that really didn't turn me on so that was kind of one of the um, uh, the cons of, of that particular program again it was free uh, so I used it for a while but I finally decided to kind of step up to the next level in my business and so what I ended up doing I found another way that I used to get around this issue by using click funnels to set up a funnel landing page same type of concept that's um, that linked um, tree had, but um, it was actually a much more professional looking platform than Linktree. Um, but there is an additional cost. There's a cost for um, using ClickFunnels. But um, uh, as I made the, the decision to step up my business, to go to the next level, realizing that's a cost that I was willing to make um, to be able to do this. And so in ClickFunnels, um, and here's kind of an example of um, one of my landing pages that I have in ClickFunnels, and the, one of the, the main reasons I uh, like using the ClickFunnels platform for this is that I can actually create a landing page with a bridge video in it. Now, bridge videos are, are really powerful if you want to be able to, first of all, brand yourself, but secondly, to warm up your prospects as you're sending them to that um, specific web page or link or offer or wherever you're sending them to. What usually happens is a lot of people will just send them to a landing page um, or to a, a capture page to collect their email address and everything else. Um, but if you put a bridge page together, then you're actually warming them up. They're seeing who you are and there's a little bit more um, familiarity with what you have to offer as you send them to the next part of um, what you want to show to them. So that was really one of the main reasons why I chose to use this. Now I've used this on others. Right now I'm primarily using the links in my um, Instagram bio to take people over to my um, Facebook community. That's where the hub of, of really where I want to connect with people and be able to um, uh, help people, to add value, to engage with people is there. And from there, then I can actually use um, this particular platform to be able to share um, um, other trainings, other tools, uh, affiliate offers, those kind of things inside my Facebook community. So that's my goal right now is I want to be generating um, leads that are going to be going into my Facebook community. And so that's what I'm using my main Instagram bio link for. Um, at some point, I think I will probably do this. Um, and I'm actually, I'm actually working on this right now is right now it takes them directly to um, Facebook Messenger. Um, which then will take them into my Facebook group. But I'm, 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 I'm in the process of actually putting together another ClickFunnels bridge page that I can kind of explain what the group's about and why they want to go there. And so that's my next step as far as my bio is going to be in my main Instagram account. Um, so you can see I'm, I'm using a lot of ClickFunnels in my business. Um, I love it. Um, in my opinion, it's worth every penny that I pay for it. Um, so it's something. Uh, if it's something that you want to check out, um, then send me um, uh, a message on that. Um, raise your hand. Say yes. I want to check it out. I've got a 14-day free trial that you can check it out um, if you're interested in that. Um, also, um, the link tree is a free program. If you want that, I can send you the link for that as well. Let me know that you're interested in that, or you can just head over there and look at that um, and check that out. But um, so these are really the two ways that you can use to maximize your Instagram bio link to promote multiple offers um, on Instagram. And it does work very well. I had several offers on there before. I saw engagement to that. And the, the interesting thing or the cool thing about both of those is now Linktree gives you kind of a limited um, 
uh, kind of like uh, it'll actually give you the stats of uh, who's clicked on what uh, particular um, link uh, or button on that page there. So it's going to give you some um, information on that. ClickFunnels does the same thing. It lets you know um, exactly you know what's um, been clicked on and, and, and where people have gone to. So both of them have the ability to give you the stats on what's taking place um, um, in those particular clicks. So I hope this was helpful to you. Um, if it was, give me a big thumbs up, like this particular video. Um, maybe you know somebody that else is using Instagram that doesn't know this information. Share that with you. you got other team members that um, uh, could use this. Definitely use this video. Share it with others as well. Um, if you would like, I, I have a lot of other videos on my YouTube channel um, that are not necessarily in this group. So if you'd like, you can head over to YouTube. Um, just search Bob Brown online. Um, and it'll bring you up and you can subscribe to my page. Um, I'm putting more and more videos over there as well, more specific ones to our group I put in here. Um, but um, you're getting a bit of training on both sides of that if you'd like it. So listen, until the next video, you have a great day and I'll be talking to you real soon. Bye now.